I repeat, these two circles are not equal. One is in fact larger than the other. What I need you to do is determine which one that is. So, please raise your hand if you believe the blue circle is larger than the red. Alright. Please raise your hand if you believe the red circle is larger than the blue. Alright, very good. Now, before I said anything about these two circles, what was your first instinct? Equal, right? Because they look equal. And the reason why they look equal is because, in fact, they are equal. These two circles are identical. <laughs> Yet I got just about every one of you to raise your hand and say that they're not. So what do we learn? That you can be manipulated like that to believe in something that goes against your natural instincts. Just, just imagine, just imagine as a child you're taught that the blue circle is larger than the red. If you say it enough times, you convince yourself that's the truth. If you're told the lie enough times, it becomes part of your reality. And if enough people are taught that lie, that the blue circle is larger than the red, well now it becomes part of the culture. And if that culture then passes that misinformation along to the next generation, well now it becomes tradition. And what we have to remember is that just because we have a tradition doesn't mean it's morally acceptable. Tradition and...